Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. Today I have a really cool product for you. Uh, it's one of those, it's one of those products that is sort of so simple in design with so many useful features that it just, you start playing with it and you're like, oh my God, this thing's, this thing's awesome. And that is the Raptor adapter. Molly mag pouch, Molly adapter. Uh, from Warrior Guardian Solutions. So before we go any further, two quick things. Number one, Warrior Guardian Solutions did send this out to me uh, and I've had them for a few months now. I got them late uh, 2022. I've had them for a few months now. Really like them. This has been a long, this is, review has actually been a long time coming. I've used them. Uh, pr if you've seen me in my war belt uh, at any point in time from late 2022 to now, I've been using these Raptor adapters and I absolutely love them. Number two, if you want to support the channel, hit that like, share, subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Remember to hit all, not all notifications so you can get more videos from me. And leave a comment down below. It helps with the channel immensely, and it also helps with the YouTube algorithm to not only get my content, but other 2A content out there into the uh, internet sphere for other people that may not normally be able to see it. You can also become a member of the channel. It's very inexpensive. You get unboxings, members only posts, and previews of upcoming videos if you go that route i do absolutely appreciate it youtube has been all over my channel attacking my channel um, and so between strikes and uh, demonetization of videos uh, it's getting very hard to uh, continue putting the output continue putting out the content that i'm putting out uh, without getting uh, some sort of a punishment for so if you want to support the channel that's awesome thank you so I first saw these and here's some examples of them right here right I first saw these on a gentleman's Instagram feed a guy that I follow a guy that I have a lot of respect for I he has he uh, has a good moral center he puts out tons of good content good training content good information and that's css shooting derek over there uh cool dude talked to him a bunch of times on various social media platforms and that's the first time i saw these thought they were cool then and then a handful of months later warrior guardian solutions contacted me uh so a quick shout out to derek over there css shooting uh i'm gonna put a link to his instagram down below so you can see him as well so the raptor adapter from warrior guardian solutions they sell what is this six variations or something like that so there's the adapt one two and three adapt one being single molly adapt two being two molly and adapt three being three pretty simple and then they have the micro which is for a inch and three quarter belt like a uh, like this battle belt they have a micro um, they have a short which i don't actually have a short here uh, but the short is for the full two inch belt uh, type battle belt and then they have the adapt it's just it doesn't have a special name and that's the full three inches of or or two full three full i guess that depends on how you look at it but the full length uh for standard molly spacing so what is this goofy gray uh sort of almost carbon fiber looking product what is this well it's something called Tegris. now i don't know a whole lot about Tegris. it has been showing up here and there within tactical gear and it's a super lightweight super thin super sturdy heavy duty material uh, with a high wear point and rigid for as thin as it is when i say thin i mean this stuff is super thin which is one of its benefits and now i got through all that and i mentioned benefits so what the hell are these things for right 
Well, they are a Molly adapter, primarily for taking the place of these TechLock type units and variations of tech lock but uh, these sort of belt loop tech lock open up right open up someday you know type dudes and uh, they take the place of these these are super bulky super cumbersome loose on everything you put them on i've had i have these uh i have a battle belt at home that's lined with these uh, they're hard to use on battle belts you have to add velcro to them they have they don't have a very wide load bearing surface um, I've never liked these. I've always thought these sucked. The only good thing about these things is how good the retention of them are because they do actually have a locking mechanism um, to lock them in place. Outside of that, I think these things are absolutely freaking horrible. And Warrior Guardian Solutions has a solution for that. And that is these guys. Now this is the Adapt2 Micro. And so as you can see, there's some similarities. Can you see that? So anything that this adapts to, like these HSGI mag pouches, you can screw the adapt, Raptor adapter to. Now, not only does this help with thickness and help with uh, security, but it also allows you, because the way he has drilled the holes in them, it allows you to, and I'm using this as an example because I, my mag pouches are attached to my belt, but if this was the mag pouch, it allows you to cant your mag pouches or whatever else you're putting on here, uh, knife, sheath, whatever. It allows you to cant that at various degrees because of the way the mounting solution is here, the way the, the holes are drilled in relation to tech lock holes. Now, before I get to the belt and show you sort of how they mount, um, another benefit of these guys, and again, they're in various sizes to these large Adapt 3s that are the full three rows of Molly or three inches. Uh, the shorts, the Adapt 2s for, for two and, and one. Uh, so I know I'm holding up the littlest one in, on camera. I don't know why, that's stupid. But <laughs> um, one of the biggest, one of the other benefits, I should say, of these is that if you have, say, a Molly pouch, um, for instance, an IFAC, right? IFACs are, unless it's purpose built for your, to wear on a belt, a standard IFAC that you may Molly to a backpack or your kit, uh, they're not exactly uh, friendly when it comes to wearing on a belt. But you could put this through the Molly right through the molly of the ifac and have this if you still want to use a tech lock have this mounted to it and now you have a belt mounted molly something pouch whatever that pouch is um, so there's mag pouches out there that don't come with these and they only use molly straps or some sort of a uh, some sort of a uh oh they're coming to get me now so there are pouches like this dump pouch for instance that would suck to wear on a belt however if I were to remove the molly straps from that replace it this into where the straps were and put that on I could easily wear it on any duty belt uh, or any non molly belt like a standard two inch belt uh, that would that say like police use uh, or a, even an EDC belt. So they not only get rid of this because these suck and I hate these, <laughs> but not only do they get rid of this and bring your mag pouches in tighter and more securely as far as movement this way, uh, but they also adapt non uh, tech lock things to tech lock so you can wear it on a belt so really there is <laughs> a seemingly endless amount of things that these guys can do but let's get down to the belt real quick I want to show you just sort of simply how they go on uh, and how secure they really are all right so this is the kind of strap that came on the HSGI pouch and 
As it pertains to the rifle mag pouch, they're not horrible. They allow for a little bit of up and down when you're drawing the mag, but they still allow for some of this. These are a very soft, pliable material. As it pertains to being a single on the mag pouches, these suck. I hate these um, because the mag pouch just goes back and forth. It has an up and down movement and everything else. And the Raptor adapter has solved that with their micro uh, and then, of course, the other sizes. So what you do is you screw this to the mag pouch. You lace this through the molly and then screw it down to itself. And it comes with all the hardware you could need has the Chicago screws and uh, rubber grommets and things like that, whatever it is that you need. And voila, not only do you have a very low profile setup at this point because it, uh, um, things like this tend to tech lock things, tend to stand things off of your body quite a bit, but these are super, I mean super secure. Now, this piece of trash aside, uh, if I were to have tech lock mounts on something like these mag pouches, I would have to put the mount over the belt, which now takes up all kinds of room, and then buy Velcro, sticky back Velcro, the hook side, put it on here because it would be showing on this side of the belt. That way I didn't have 10 inches of belt space that didn't attach to my inner belt. Again, these, I don't like them at all. However, again, on the inverse, if you wanted to mount something that is just molly and doesn't have a tech lock or screw holes in it, you can use these on something like that and attach a tech lock to put on your belt. So again, this is one of those solutions that I, it's almost hard to fathom that nobody had come up with it before um, because these have been a constant source of aggravation for many people uh, and securely, and I don't, when I say securely, I don't mean it ripping off. I mean it not having forward back movement, not being loose on your belt and securely ma uh, uh, mounting mag pouches to any belt has always been a point of issue. And I think these Warrior Guardian Solutions uh, Raptor adapters have really done that and more. So I know you're asking yourself, how much are these miracle products to the tactical industry? And I really do think that they are, they are that. That's my absolute honest opinion. You guys know me. If I think something's trash, I am not afraid to say so. And I've been super happy with these. So how much are these? They got to be expensive, right? They got to be super expensive. You know, kind of that Tegris is sort of a new product. Uh, it's it, 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 They're going to break the bank, right? Wrong. They range from $16 down to $6, six or, six or $8. I can't remember the lowest one. But they are super inexpensive, especially for the amount of uh, adaptability they have. And I know I'm using adapt a lot, but they really have a... a a very wide range of adaptability from different mag pouches, uh, knife sheaths, anything that has screw holes in it, things like that. Now, the one thing uh, when I spoke to the gentleman that owns Warrior Guardian Solutions, uh, when I spoke to him, he did say that he does not suggest putting a holster on these. Uh, we didn't get into a whole lot of reasons why, uh, but there is a reason holster mounts are super heavy duty. Uh, when you think about things like the uh, uh, Safari Land stuff and things like that, there's a reason these are super heavy duty. Um, and while and while these things are very heavy duty for what they are, uh, I don't think that they're going to take the place of a giant polymer or plastic platform that you would wear your duty holster on. So that is, that is uh, one thing to keep in mind. So I'd like to thank Warrior Guardian Solutions for sending these out. Again, this has been a review long time coming. I think they're super awesome products, a lot of uh, uh, advantages to them, and really zero disadvantages as far as when I think about all the other malice clips and uh, molly sticks, those things are trash too, but molly sticks, 
uh, uh, various uh, 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 malice clips, uh, these things that come with HSGI, and then of course the tech lock. When I think of all the other products that this competes against, all those other products have at least one major con in my book, in my view. And I can't think of a negative thing to say about these from their ability to adjust cant and angle to what they can adapt things to and what they can adapt things away from i can't think of a negative thing to say about these and that's pretty rare for me um, i usually can find at least one negative thing to say about a product these are inexpensive and yeah i can't uh, it's super useful again one of those things where I kind of go I can't believe they nobody came out with these before so check them out I'm gonna put a link to warrior guardian solutions in the pinned comment and there will also be a link in the description to my website rttgunsgear.com which will have this video it will have the information about warrior guardian solutions and all the adapt models in the post that you are linked to Again, thank you to Warrior Guardian Solutions for sending these out. Again, a big shout out to CSS Shooting uh, over there. Check him out as well. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Leave a comment. You know the drill. We'll talk to you later.